this is Checkers, back again with another episode of our State of Decay 2 Let's Play, this time with episode 8. And we are still trying to build up our settlement, but looking also perhaps to find a little better place to be. Seriously? Oh, fuck that! Talk to Felix. <sighs> Okay, well, let's go talk to Felix and see what just happened. Warlord, that doesn't sound good. I don't really want to get Eric here killed. That's good. Where's Felix? Flashlight on. Where is Felix? No, really. Here's Felix. They took off with our food and ran into the garage. If we let people take from us, it will never end. I'll handle the thief. Should be hard. All right, let's do it. They ran into what garage? Don't do anything you regret. Maybe the thief just needs help. Uh -huh. Right here, huh? Okay, ranged weapon, check. Edged weapon, or blunt weapon, anyway. Check, melee weapon. Word I, I really strongly wanted. suggest that you drop everything. Hey, All right, let's get up here. Watch the noise. Watch where you're pointing that. Watch where I'm pointing it. I only took a little food. I'm starving. I don't necessarily want to kill him. Give back what you told and I'll tell a stole and I'll let you walk hey, out of here. We can work this out. Feels good to take out the trash. They won't be bothering us anymore. Did he do it? Yeah, he did it. All right. I mean, if there had been an option to like give him a little bit, I would have done that. But may as well search the place while we're here. Building supplies, seeds. Ooh, pry bar, Molotov. Another fuel can. Awesome. I don't think we need to claim the outpost, but... Just drop this stuff back at home. Grab those building supplies. Maybe we should gas up the car and go for a... Well, let's see. We still have something at the... Hopefully. We still have something at the... People are gonna get sick unless we score more meds. Okay, um, I have... Let's see, Molotov... Actually, no, we're gonna take a fuel can with us. Uh, put the seeds away, gonna keep that pry bar too, just so he has a backup weapon. Let's drop this food back. And then we'll go get those... Building supplies. Okay. Cardio is up to four seven. Building supplies. Easy there. We'll get your cardio up there, Eric. Don't you worry. 
I am a heartless taskmaster, and I will make sure you're in excellent shape. Okay. And we go, off we drop. Whoa. And into the shelving we run. Close that up. Now... I feel like passing out. Oh, probably not. Trust me, I do it all the time. Yet. Okay. And at some point, that's why I think one of the reasons we need a bigger settlement, we need a way to repair our weapons, which I'm pretty sure is going to involve a workshop. Okay, what can we specialize in? Fighting. We can do striking, increased knockdown with blunt weapons, or increased health trauma accrued more slowly. That's what we'll do then. And we get a slam attack. Okay, so now into here, I believe where we get another rucksack of food. Um, is that thinker guy still hanging around? Apparently not. Oh well, can't win them all. At least not until I get more of my phenomenal cosmic powers or something. here to tell you a permanent bedtime story. It all began with a beautiful red crowbar. Okay. And here's a horde. Okay, let's close that back up. Internet connection restored. Well, how the hell I the screamers end up looking good. so damn weird? Well, hello there. How you doing? Um, hey guys. I know that most of you are clueless, but there does seem to be a horde right outside the door. Um. Seriously, I swear there's, like, shouldn't there be a tower? Am I being obtuse again? Kitchen, staging area, forge, auto shop, barracks, infirmary, sheltered beds, garden, garden, morale and training, lounge, defense and utilities. This is, oh, I thought this was 
the shooting training. This is the shooting training. So yes, I was being obtuse. Five building supplies. We have 15. Set that sucker up. And while we're at it... Yeah, that's good for now. Whoa. The noise in this place is like a fucking beacon for zombies. Danny. Danny. Just, just go fix the thing. Um, zombies were already there. Survivor activity. There's, they're back at the urgent care. See, Danny, you're not much of a, not as much of an annoyance when you're actually, you know, being useful. How long is it going to take to establish our watchtower? Oh, well. Kind of hesitant to walk out the door. <laughs> Maybe I can draw him away. I don't know. Get him to come after me instead of the... That is a screamer, right? There. Oh boy. And I need to finish that one. No, you need to back off, man. Okay. Well, you know. I'm not gonna lie. We have a truckload of zombies coming in. And now there's an attack coming. Oh well, you know. Okay, reloading. Can I help? No. Love the sound of the gas lantern. Got four seconds, Danny, before you can prove how useless you are again. Why don't we close the gates? Hi. Bye. What the hell? Just practicing. Actually got quite a few 22 rounds, so you know. Why not? Oh, sorry Danny, I thought you were a zombie. Really? There you go. He had a lot on his mind. No, I don't want to talk to you. Mm. Okay. Danny thought I was a zombie there too. See, as long as we don't back down, we'll keep winning. Eric is now a hero. We're going nowhere fast. Okay, let's use up a bandage. Let's see what that means, Eric being a hero and all. Taking risks. People know that if there's something risky to do, I'll take care of it. They can stay safe inside, plus five max health. Leadership Warlord. We establish peace through, through strength. Build an arsenal and destroy all outside threats. Eric, I like the way you think. I really do. Okay. Oh. Alright, let's go see what's going on over at the... Uh, urgent Care. We do have to find a bigger, better place to settle, but I'm not really a huge fan of the dark. Because... Oh boy, what now? 
I was trying to build some explosives and it didn't work out. I'm fine though, thanks for asking. Well, I, I would have asked Lopez, but I was unaware of your Shit. plans. Okay, we had planned for that. We're dropping the crowbar. And now we can roll out. Now let's set our waypoint, which is a lot more helpful in the really bloody dark. Eric, taking care of business. I love this donkey thing. It's a donkey or a horse. Well, his ears kind of look like donkey ears to me. Okay, let's check the back of this card just because I noticed it and I might forget. In, you know, 200 years, people will be worshipping that donkey. That's not what I wanted. Um, we can upgrade his wits. Scouting increased st scouting range and passive enemy detection or stealth. Quicker sneaking, quieter interactions and reduced visibility to enemies. Hmm. Although I normally really do love stealth. Let's go with scouting. That whole enemy detection range could be really, really awesome. I have got to see this donkey. Horse. Is, is it a mule that's the mix? Maybe then it's a mule. That way everyone can be happy. There, look at that epic, epic portrait. Eric and the graven idol. All right. Um, Watch that mission just disappear while I'm out here playing with the donkey and the car parts. All right. So. Right here. Tyeb. Hi, Tyeb. I could really use some medicine right now. The spacious warehouse looked promising, but I can't go alone. Can you help me? I'll offer a fair exchange. Uh, sure. I'll help you. Got you got it. What does that mean? Wait oh, on. Sure. Wow, these guys are way more reasonable than my other community. I don't even have to, you know, bring my passport to get to this one. Looks like I found the right place. We're not quite alone. Yet. You think? What gave it away? Of course. Uh, no, Ty, I, I made that mistake already. Is there anything in there? Hello. Just a... What is going on? Dude, there's an opening right there. Now here we may actually have to climb the wall. Can we do that? Oh, look at you go, Eric. You're a boss, man. Of course you're now alone. Because... What's his name? used up his wall climbing charges for the day. Okay. Come on, Tyeb. Can we do it? We can do it. Hello. More in here and more on the way. But they use openings the way Ty abuses openings, so we're safe. Hell, this is practically made to order for an outpost. And then Ty up. Okay. Um, 
I hear ya. Still got company. I hear ya. <laughs> Is that one down? I can't. Seriously, flashlight should point where I point. Not where the mo why? Okay, somebody who knows more about development, explain now to me why. I'm lucky. I think this is what we're looking for. Okay, talk to Taya. We there may want to thank you. Hey, thanks for the building supplies. Okay, so as I was saying, if you're more familiar with game development, why why do characters in predominantly console third person, first person shooters, why do they move like they're shopping carts with bad wheels? I, I really don't quite understand that. What's the motivation there? Is it to hide the fact that the controller is relatively less precise? Is it some misguided attempt at realism? I'm, I'm not quite following along here. But that is probably my single biggest complaint in a lot of games, is I cannot stand imprecise movement. And I think a lot of games that people think I would normally be like all over, I, I don't play them because I really don't like that broken shopping cart feel. Thanks to what? Okay, well, something's better somewhere. There's a container I'm missing, but it is just too dark. Clearing those playing cards isn't fun, but we gotta do it. Oh, there we go. I don't see anybody stopping you there, Meredith. Time to move on. Oh, building supplies. So, okay, there's what we've got on our back and a whole other set in here. And I'm not trying to be, again, I'm not trying to be PC Master Race about the whole movement thing. I really don't understand it. Having watched games change over 40 years, it's, that is it's one a nasty looking feral. step of regression that I just don't get. There's a feral where? Where do you, can you see him on the map? No, nope. all right. Well, then we're just gonna move. Oh, there is just. I think I can go much longer without a rest. You can chase me. You might not live through it, but you can chase me. driveway we climb you know what would be an awesome upgrade for that gate like a spring hinge that closes it after we go in that would be epic okay Seeds and stuffs and parts and plague zombie pieces and an axe, fuel can and bullets that we're gonna hang on to. And we we're down to the last one. Bandage. Let's pull. We've got to have spares in here. There we go. Okay. Now we have 
A watchtower. Look at us go. And 15 building supplies. So, genie requests. Plague on the community. Well, we know we've got building supplies in there. We could try and get back. Although we're not going to make it in this episode, so... Hey, if you're listening and feeling helpful, could you swing by? Thanks. The Gleaners, huh? Alright, well... Let's see what... Oh. Well, they are close by, so... Let's see what we find. That we have time to do, I think. Although, well, hopefully Eric's got some go left in him. He's been rather busy tonight. Hello. Cardio just went up. What do you got? Okay, I appreciate the tutorial stuff, but why would you put it over the place? I mean, this, this would be really lovely right here. Okay, cardio. Specialize, marathon, or powerhouse. Reduced stamina cost for melee, grappling, and finishers, or sprinting. Well, we went with sprinting for Danny. Let's try powerhouse for... Eric here. So he's still burning stamina like crazy for running, but hopefully he'll be able to hang in fights longer. So which one are we going to? This one right here. Hey, I'm over here. Okay, I still don't see you. There you are. Hi, Kila, Kyla, Kalia. I'm in dire need of fuel. I heard there could be some over at the corner store, but I can't get to it. Can you help me out? I'm willing to give you something in return if we find some. Sure, I'll help yeah, you I... find some fuel. Okay, you lead the way. Okay, where is... Oh. Man, we can get all this done within this episode. Right on. Until, Looks like you know, I found the right place. We find out that she wants us to yeah, take her home on the other side of the map. Try some of this powerhouse action out, huh? Don't give that screamer a chance to yell. <laughs> There's a screamer? There's a screamer. You got that, right? Because I'm looking for this really screamer. Enjoy the peace and quiet while I can. Oh, we're in the wrong building? Of course we're in the wrong building. What do you say we clean this place up? Okay, well. Not super thrilled for giving you fuel, but... Is this... Yeah, corner store. Okay. Ooh, a cookie. Taking that. Taking these huggies and whatever else you got behind the register. Um, meds, okay. Backpack, a seven slot backpack, okay. Uh, coffee wouldn't hurt, but that's the claim outpost. I, you know, Kalea, it won't break my heart if you look at things too. I swear. See, Genie, can you come with me? Go to a place, find everything I need, I think then this give is what it to we're me. Looking for. Did you find the fuel that I need? Like I said, I'm willing to give you something in return if you did find some. Here you go, rucksack of fuel to Kalia. You are the best. Well, thanks. You folks might be my last chance to survive. Do you want to join? Hiring, I've got lots of experience, and I can start right away. Let's see what she's got. Well, she's got fuel. Construction, wow, nice. Shooting, wits aren't bad. Cardio, fighting and shooting, could stand some work, but 
Sure. If you're hiring, I've got lots of experience and I can start right away. Sweet. You can Welcome count on me. to the team. Come on back. I'll show you the ropes. And we've got some meds. Yeah, let's do this. We're gonna go a little long this episode. service, ma'am. Somebody's having munchies over in the bushes. Hello. Seriously. Why would you put the help text there? Why would you put the help text there? See, now entering Eastman Heights, that's a great place to put help text. It's completely out of the way. So guys, I found a new friend. It's gonna be epic. Here it is. Not much, but it's home. You are the best. Great, come on, drop off your. We'd be able to do more around here if fuel. we had water access. Heavy sigh. Okay, so drop off our things and all of our other things. Uh, maybe we should hang on to that. Well, no, we've got our bandages. And cookery or carpenter's hatchet. Cookery. Okay. So, I think we'll call this an end to the episode. And we'll see how these last three did. Six, seven, and eight. I, like I said, I really enjoy the game. I like the post-apocalyptic stuff. The Fallout 4s, the States of Decay. And uh, we'll see. All right, for the moment, I would like to say thank you for watching. I hope you found the video entertaining and maybe just a little informative. I would like to invite you to subscribe, like, and share if you so desire, and to ask you, above all, to please take care. <laughs>